The Equalizer 3 director, Antoine Fuqua, recently opened up about the chemistry between Denzel Washington and Dakota Fanning. Apparently, they are good friends, and Dakota is also close to the actor's children. You could definitely tell they had a history, Antoine said. Their friendship began to flourish after their previous collaboration in Man on Fire, which occurred almost two decades ago. This sweet on-screen reunion is indeed a special moment for fans. But what about Denzel's real-life chemistry? This is where I'm supposed to be. An awkward first date, two rejected proposals, and constant divorce rumors. This Hollywood couple has seen it all. But Denzel Washington and his wife Pauletta managed to stay by each other's side. Welcome to Rumor Juice. In today's episode, we'll look into this whirlwind romance that has lasted for nearly 40 years. This is our fate. I think it's our fate. It's nothing's magic. It's work. Yes. Denzel and Pauletta met in 1977 on the set of Wilma, and although they immediately clicked, it wasn't until a year later that they finally became a couple. The legendary actor shared on Jimmy Kimmel Live that their first date was quite awkward, adding that he still argues with Pauletta over who actually paid for the cab. But it wasn't that fairy tale Hollywood romance story, with love at first sight changing everything. Actually, Pauletta wasn't quite sure whether Denzel was the one until she understood their marriage was meant to be. While they met on set for the first time, Denzel and Pauletta spoke briefly at a mutual friend's party for the first time. She recalled the moment. I thought he was cute, but I fell in love with his spirit, really. Really? Yeah, that, that I saw first. And then I thought, hmm, not a bad package. You know? Later that night, Pauletta decided to go out and see a play. The theater was dark, and she didn't notice who was the man sitting beside her. When the lights were lifted for intermission, she realized she and Denzel were sitting directly beside each other. Pauletta instantly knew it was fate. Several years after their first date, Denzel was ready to pop the question, but Pauletta initially turned him down. In a hilarious 2013 interview with Access Hollywood, the couple jokingly sparred about how many times Denzel proposed before finally getting a yes. Denzel remembered it was only once, but Pauletta set him straight. It was twice. Why was it twice? Why would I have to ask again? Wondered a bewildered Denzel. Because I said no, Pauletta replied. You heard it here first, he then joked. She turned me down. She said no. And since it was three times, that means she turned me down twice. Because she kept telling me no. Oh, no. So I don't remember where I was and when she so finally. Which time? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Thankfully, the third time was the charm, and the couple married in the early 80s. How did they keep the flame burning? It appears that Denzel and Pauletta are genuine and hopeless romantics. They even renewed their vows in a ceremony in South Africa, with a well-known activist and Archbishop Desmond Tutu officiating at the occasion. When asked about his key to a happy marriage, Denzel joked, I do what I'm told, I keep my mouth shut. But the actor later got more contemplative about what had really held him and Pauletta together over the years and gave his wife a huge amount of the credit. What pops into my head? Security, food, a beautiful home, he said. Denzel believes there's a tremendous difference between a house and a home. You could buy a house, but it doesn't mean that you'd immediately call it home, he revealed. My wife has made our house a home and raised these beautiful kids and protected them and sacrificed for them. She did the heavy lifting. What's more, Denzel struggled to build a happy family as he grew up in a dysfunctional environment. Pauletta taught him all the love and closeness that made them inseparable. After living in a broken home during his childhood, Denzel promised himself to make it different with Pauletta. But what about Pauletta? How does she feel about their marriage dynamics? Though she is tight-lipped about her personal life, Pauletta opened up about the experience of being the strong woman behind that powerful man. Following on from a previous answer about former First Lady Michelle Obama, Pauletta noted, Any woman behind an influential man has always been there. Maybe the public and the media is now saying we recognize you, but take it from me, I've been on the scene a long time. She went on to acknowledge that Denzel had been far more in the public eye than she had, but it had made no difference to their connection. No doubt the couple learned a few things about what makes their lasting love work. But it's a miracle they stayed together despite rumors of Denzel cheating on Pauletta. In 2013, pictures of Denzel kissing another woman reportedly leaked, spurring rumors that the couple was headed for divorce. 
Both Denzel and Pauletta denied the gossip, but acknowledged that marriage took a lot of work. I don't know what statistics are, or I don't know if people in show business have a higher rate of divorce, but I just think that you have to work at it," Denzel wrote in a Reddit AMA. He shared that it's crucial not to give up on each other. Pauletta addressed the cheating rumors calmly. She revealed, I live with this man. I see the down part. I see the sad part. I see every part. He has and knows he has that stability in me as his wife. That gives him strength, regardless of if he misuses it. I can't dwell on that. Denzel and Pauletta are parents of four, and it hasn't been an easy journey. Speaking of Denzel, it was almost impossible for him to combine parenting and acting. Maybe that's why he admitted that the major source of his power was always his wife's support. Yes, she safeguarded their family together all along the way. Pauletta stayed strong in the wake of all the challenges that could destroy the couple's personal life. Well, listen, my wife, you know, is the backbone of our family, you know, and I'm wise enough to admit that. Their parenting style has been a hybrid. As Denzel shared, it's a mixture of what he and his wife learned from their parents. He added, my wife's done a great job. She's been the consistent one, trying to give them a normal life. And the couple's children actually followed in their parents' footsteps. My, my father taught me how to hunt. My mother taught me how to love. Their eldest son, John David, is an actor and recently starred in Spike Lee's Oscar-nominated Black Klansman. Their oldest daughter, Katya, is also an actress. While twins Olivia and Malcolm are starting their own careers in showbiz and studied filmmaking and acting. Fatherhood is clearly a responsibility that Denzel takes very seriously. It's been more than four decades since that game-changing first date when Denzel and Pauletta found their connection. And their love flourishes as always while they seem to be lovestruck throughout all the time they've been together. We're also sure that no matter where these two are, they'll always flash the biggest, brightest smiles. That's what good love will do to you. Talking about their long-lasting marriage with Oprah Winfrey, Denzel said, People who say they knew if their spouse was the one right away are lying. It's a marathon, not a sprint. That's why we hope Denzel and Pauletta will be Mr. and Mrs. Washington forever and ever. We've been wondering, what do you think about their relationship? Please let us know and stay tuned for more juicy celebrity stories.